heading out to a coffee shop. There's a coffee shop on my block, but it's Mighty O Donuts, and it's just too many fucking kids. I can't like just sit on my laptop and chill out with all those kids screaming. So I walk two blocks down the road to another coffee shop. I don't think I got much work done in there. I did catch quite a few Pokemon, but I don't think that counts as work. <laughs> but I was just sketching out, slowly sketching out ideas for an Angie's Phalanges music video. And uh, I think I'm going way too ambitious for what my filmmaking skill level is. But um, I'm gonna start experimenting with some of the ideas I have in the video. So at least, I don't know, upgrade my film making skills, I might realize I have to compromise quite a bit to make it work. Who knows? Anyway, I'm going to get ready for my jog right now and then head out to Star Trek in the park. I mean, Outdoor Trek. My legs are hurting. I don't think I'm going to make it to all the way to the beach. Fairly close, but now I'm going to head back right now. My shins feel like evilly painful. Whatever. I got most of the way there so uh did 20 minutes so far 20 minutes back so a 40 minute jog still good that was a really really shitty jog slow very very slow didn't make it all the way to the beach and man my legs hurt i guess uh el borracho does not help with jogging the next day Tried to stop at Wendy's to get some quick food before going to the park, but there's like two families in line and being completely indecisive on what they want and it's fucking Wendy's. You get a burger and fries and go the fuck home. It's not that hard. So I bailed because I didn't want to wait 20 minutes just to get shitty fast food. So I'm going to the park with no food, but maybe I'll uh, run up to Starbucks and grab a sandwich from there on the way or once in there at the park. I'm hungry though. I totally forgot that they have hot dogs in the park. So I'm so happy when I have a hot dog. I'm so hungry, hungry. This guy talking invented the Klingon language. In an entirety, and that line is bah! That's all, that means fire. Those lines were made up by Jimmy Doohan, James Doohan, who played Scotty on the Sears. Uh, and those lines were spoken, the actor who played that Klingon is Mark Leonard, who normally played Sarek, Spock's father. So the true origins of the Klingon language is that it was invented by a Federation engineer and spoken by a Vulcan. <laughs> <laughs> and Klingons tend to get upset when I say that. <laughs> it's absolutely true. Very sweet people, but... All right. Oh, hi. We did it. Yay! Halfway done! Oh, Woo! 
Got to turn the light back there for you. Yeah, yeah there we go. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so halfway. Oh, shit. Oh. I want to preserve whatever may be. Okay, you can you can edit this part out. What's that? Where? Hmm? Oh. Whoa, we're halfway there. Whoa! <laughs> Star Trek show. Sorry. Take my hand. We'll and do four more shows. shows. Whoa! Oh. And learn Klingon. <laughs> <sighs> Dropped off Sarah. I am back now. I'm gonna head down to El Bracho and then uh, meet up with Laura, and then I guess we'll go over to see the show at the Victory Lounge. My friends uh, and Kids on Fire are playing tonight. We'll see how things go. Last time I tried to get something going with Laura at 10 p.m., she ended up getting swamped and couldn't leave until after midnight. So we'll see if we actually make it away from El Bracho at. 10. My brain is shutting down. I kind of don't want to go, but I already said I'd go out and do stuff. kind of want to just fall asleep, but... You only live once. You can sleep when I'm dead. You've had stuff before, right? What's that? Yes. Yes. Hey, how's it going? Good. Good to see you. Good to see you. together, because that's just where we all live. Oh, can you use your lighter, Sarah? Is it easily accessible? Yes. Sure. Oh, yes, so my you're being vlogged, so this is all YouTube-ish. Oh. Well, let's, not do, let's not do drugs, because grandma. All right, I'm ending the vlog because, anyway, I thought I was going out to a show, but it's not going out to a show, and then we're going to go drink, and we're going to do stuff, and just shut I love you. Mwah. <laughs> She's going out with her friends, but they're all wary because they know how this ends. It starts out innocent enough Next thing you know, she's in the buff Alcohol makes her clothes fall off Alcohol makes her clothes fall off Alcohol makes her clothes fall off She has no more fears After two shots and three beers Stuck in our memories When she shows her memories Whoa -oh -oh -oh. Once she was treated like a queen Her friends rented her a limousine Just a shot she gave that sunroof a tug now the whole city has seen her jugs Alcohol makes her clothes fall off Alcohol makes her clothes fall off Alcohol makes her clothes fall off Like two escaping felons When she unleashes her melons Gets a room full of fans when she pops out both her cans Whoa. Um. Alcohol makes her clothes fall off 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 Like two escaping felons When she unleashes her melons She gets a room full of fans When she pops out both her cans Whoa!